Alright, what's going on everybody? We're out here again doing another day of training. Today I'm not going to be shooting pistol, I'm going to be shooting rifle. I'm going to be shooting my Troy uh, chambered in 5.56 and 223. This is what we're shooting. Um, I have my red dot that I'm going to be shooting with. Uh, I got my tack light, my iron sights, my magnifier, and my flash can. However, today I'm just going to be shooting with my red dot. I'm going to be doing a couple of drills, just um, magazine changes. Before I came out here, it was raining pretty bad. Uh, it's muddy out here, and hopefully it doesn't start raining again. But however, if it does, it is what it is. The weather should not stop you from training. You should train through snow, sleet, rain, sunny, whatever type of weather you should be training regardless. All right? So my slide lock didn't lock back on uh, when my magazine uh, ran out of ammo. So I had to rip my magazine out really quick and just switch it off. But it is what it is. Things happen, right? So what's happening is my bolt isn't locking to the rear, which I don't know why. Um, when I go, when I went to go pull my magazine out or eject my magazine, uh, my bolt just slammed right back to the uh, front. All right, let's run it again. Let's see what's happening. Well, that time it, it locked to the rear on that time what? all right so the plan today was to just do some rifle drills however I got, I got out here and uh got a little happy so I'm gonna do some pistol as well uh this is gonna be my drink that I'm gonna shoot today it's gonna be the Canik TP9 SFX that's honestly one of my favorite firearms at this point so I'm gonna shoot a little bit with this um, I'm done with my rifle. I just did a little bit of uh, magazine changes. Some of the uh, magazine changes were a little bit uh, iffy, and it's because my bolt wasn't locking to the rear. My magazine wasn't dropping clean out, uh, so I had to, you know, adjust accordingly. But it is what it is. brand new one I just got uh, first time actually shooting with it so I gotta get used to it I mean it's not too bad though for the first time shooting with it so uh, the more I do it the better I'll get just like everything else um that's it for today like comment and subscribe on my youtube channel and also if you got any advice on what i can do to get better how i can train a little different what things i can do to just get a little smoother feel free to write those in the comments as well i'm a humble dude i don't mind learning from other experienced shooters so feel free to do that and i will definitely read those comments and apply what it is that you give me as far as information i'll let you guys later